We're on your side tonight with three things to know about weight loss drugs. Prescription drugs used to suppress appetite have exploded in popularity this past year, with social media influencers and celebrities sharing the successes that they've had using semeglutide, marketed as Wegovy and Ozempic. They're known technically as GLP-1 agonists. Like, who's that person in the mirror? It's hard to believe it's me. It's this miracle, and I've got to pinch myself sometimes to say, is this real? Jennifer Huber's success stories is one of many. According to a recent survey, about one in eight U.S. adults have used medication to lose weight. And the drugs aren't just aiding in weight management. We see them helping with uh, blood sugar control and diabetes. We see uh, benefits in heart disease and likely to see more to come. Dr. Scott Butch specializes in treating obese patients, and he says the first thing here to know about these new weight loss drugs is that they're not for everyone. Right now, the medications are approved to treat people with obesity, not those just trying to shed a few pounds. Thing two here, GLP-1 agonists may lead to more pregnancies because of how they work. And since there's not enough research on the effect this medication may have on a pregnancy, patients should stop taking the drugs at least two months before trying to get pregnant. So now to thing three here. Butch says insurance, keep this in mind, doesn't cover the medication for weight loss. Bias exists around obesity that affects both the reasons why insurance companies are not covering anti-obesity medications like these, as well as why certain uh, implementation of obesity treatments, like seeing a dietitian, for example, isn't covered by uh, most insurance companies. Also keep in mind there are potential side effects like nausea, vomiting, constipation, diarrhea, and fatigue. Three things to know about weight loss drugs. Thanks for watching tonight. We certainly appreciate that. WBTV News is back at 11 o'clock. And, of course, we'll see you back here tomorrow night at 7 for another edition of On Your Side Tonight. Have a great evening. We'll see you tomorrow.